All right, guys, we're back. Uh, I got Professor Boo here with me, and it's a little follow-up to the omoplata technique that we did in our previous video. So Professor Boo is going to show one of his favorite escapes uh, when you're caught in the omoplata technique. All right. All right. Cool. Now from here, we always, especially in gi, we can hide our hand and anchor our arm so we don't get shoulder locked. We have our hand out for base so we're good and stable. So if he tries to kick, I have a good base keeping me uh, sturdy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lift. I'm gonna slide my inside knee right up under Professor Guy's butt. This way, it's gonna be really hard for him to kick. I have a foot out for a base, for a post, and I'm in a good place. Now, a lot of times they're gonna try to throw legs over or we're gonna bring them over. So he can't kick and get me flat, so I'm gonna control the ankle. I'm gonna duck under. First finish we can do is we can extend our shoulders, hit a little foot lock here. If not, all we're gonna do is look up to the sky, proud chest, do a wrestling sit out, come around, get your side control, get our arm out nice and quick so they don't get reverse triangle. The biggest thing is guys, we have to get our knee under his butt. So when I lift, I slide, just like I'm sliding the home plate. I've got base and his hips are controlled. Head comes under, foot lock, look up to the sky, proud chest, turn, rotate, side control, Get that arm out so it don't get triangled, and that's how we get out. It's one of my favorite escapes. You're safe, you don't have to think about rolling out into an arm lock, and you're good to go. You're nice and stable. All right, guys, if you have any questions at all or any comments, just post them uh, below, and um, look forward to seeing you guys on the next one. Thanks.